Let's go spot all the original Death Squad the fourth. This is Chance Against Devils the third one, because you, Mr. Venicor. Back to the lab. Hope you enjoy your stay entertainment along the way. Crank it the speakers, don't touch your beakers, give away every week. Please take a seat, but you'll only need the edge. Hmm. That was very menacing. <laughs> Any of y'all remember a TV show cartoon called Kids Next Door? This guy, his silhouette, reminds me of the dad. The evil dad from Kids Next Door. It was always a dark silhouette with a pipe. Designing the entirety of the system by himself. But we conflicted over our intentions. And what happened to him? Ruben has been dealt with. The consequences of trusting the wrong people. Ruvik, he knows I'm here. There's an axe. And an invisible monster. I can't, I'm not in control. It's cinematic right now. Oh, the light shows him? Sneak kills. Uh, instantly kill an enemy with an axe. Axe is consumed upon use. What? Okay. Using the axe, instantly kill enemies who are unaware of you from sneaking. Sneak kill does not work on some enemies. Just pick the axe back up. I guess that makes too much sense. What was that? I saw something I could, oh, it's cover. Dude, I hate the cover system. I'm just curious, what did other people think of this DLC? Hang on a second. Mostly positive. Okay, I guess I'm just the odd one out. Like, I really, really like the base game, but just so far, I'm just like, bleh about this. Take that knife? No? Something else is even more harrowing. Our subjects are dying. They come out from stem abruptly passing with looks of horror in their eyes. The ones that do survive are catatonic, babbling, incoherent messes that we can't properly interview. We've done nothing to the process to cause this change. It must be the ever-growing collective consciousness of the stem system. These patients seem unable to take the strain of exposure. We need more sane subjects, perhaps to cleanse the system. At its current state, the system is unsustainable. Something Mobius will not approve of. This time, only I am to blame for this. Our new prototype and beacon is almost ready. When it is, I will start its conversion to the wireless system. Even if the original STEM experiments go awry, I will show my worth to Mobius with its next generation. Um, Ashton Strike says the DLC and base game feel like two different genres. The base game was action horror, the DLC is more like Penumbra. Oh boy. Uh, I played Penumbra Overture, and I liked it so little I did not play any of the other games.
Have you watched Morbius? No. No, I'm not. this yes but nothing we can get I don't even know if we have an inventory in this game it doesn't seem like we do are you serious right now drop. Oh, I don't like that sound. Chat, it's like nails on a chalkboard. Yo, I would have been moving. Oh! God, that looked painful. She just like smacked her nose on the ground. Dude, if you don't have a nosebleed, you lying. Wait, her light changes them or wait or, or, or like reanimates them? Oh, he's turning into the crab guy. Why is there a random gun here? Oh no. <laughs> okay, I didn't ever look at the clip. I don't even know how many shots I had. All right, so can I only shoot them when they're red, like blow them up when they're red maybe? Infinite clips. Oh, she can't aim any more left. She cannot aim any more left than that. There was an invisible wall, and her arm would not go any more left than that point. Why do the monsters go out of range of what you can shoot if you're rooted to the ground?
Is she gonna get her leg out easily now? I'm glad to see it taking some effort. I would have been kind of mad if she got it out easily now. If Leslie's down here, I doubt he'll last long. I've got to find him. I appreciate this. It's some kind of explanation on why there was a gun there. I appreciate this. Um, however, it is not allowing me to change, even though I know there's no bullets, I cannot change to the gun. It won't let me do it. It's no flying truck with a gun on top of it, but it'll do. I almost forgot about the flying truck. <laughs> I appreciate that this man died from my immersion, right? I mean, if you don't appreciate him, then what's the point? Dad. Completely expendable. They have no bearing on the mission. If they get in the way, you know what to do. <gasps> I hear cat. The sound of save. It's honestly kind of weird that they don't just add a checkpoint there. Like, why do a checkpoint in some spots and... Yo, the cat's eating good, chat. Do you see this? It's on a plate and everything. It's like, why not just have a checkpoint here? Why a safe spot? Creepy doll. I don't know why, but I finally, I, I, I suddenly see myself thinking of a uh, guck in EverQuest. Do we have the whole paper yet? I guess not. Time for some console gaming. There's some crunchy boys over there.
Oh, wow, I remember you. The hook guys. Perhaps one of the giants? I can't really tell. Yeah, those are bosses Sebastian has to fight. They're just on ice right now or something. to go back through the way I came. Oh, I bet it's going to be very different now that I took the power junction thing out of it. Did I just let everything loose? Is it hashtag my fault those monsters are out? Women in games, especially in action games, do wear high heels and move around like it's nothing. Are high heels really that much more sexy? No. <laughs> no. Like, at, like, a, a party or, like, a fancy event or something. Like, someone walking around slowly in high heels. Yeah, it can, it can look good. But just, like, all the time? No, it kind of looks clowny. Yep, I think it's our fault. I thought it was open enough I could go through it. I didn't realize that... I'm guessing it has to be all the way up. Like 100% of the way up for the door to open. Dang it. I thought it was open enough. Oh my god, we're back here. Uh. Oh hey, we're out of stamina. I made the mistake of running five feet. You good? You catch your breath? I swear, I sit in a room and stream like nine hours a day, and I'm pretty sure, in fact, quite positive, I can do like a <laughs> hundred times more cardio than this guy, this lady. You were at the other end of the hallway. Do not suddenly clip in here. Uh oh.
<laughs> I mean, honestly, Sebastian didn't have like a massive stamina bar at the beginning of the game either, but you could level it up. You, you know, like at the beginning of the game, I think he, he could sprint for four seconds, but by the end of the game, I had it up to like 12 or something like that. This one just, it never gets better. All right, now we wait for him to pass. Why is the MC in this mansion anyway or the chat? No, we're in like, we're actually in a guy's head. Uh, we're actually in this like mental hellscape of this guy that uh, was in an asylum. Wait, what the heck? This isn't what you did the other time. Oh God, do we actually have to bait you over here? Where'd he go? Hey. Ooh, epilepsy warning. I wonder if I could run him back out into the hallway, crawl through that thing again, and come back here and get some time to work on the, the door. The funny thing is, I think the other less lore-related DLC is more at Mux Alley. Uh, that one is all action. You mean, um, what is it called? Executioner? He's behaving different in this hallway. The first two times he did the same thing. The third time he did something completely different. And then the fourth time he did something different again. I should have stomped his toe. Just bite him. Ah. Are you gonna move? Shoot him. I don't have uh, any bullets. Did he just throw a stick at me?
Come on, give me a checkpoint. It hasn't given me a checkpoint yet. I don't want to do that again. You know, an 18th time. She's like, man, I hope that monster doesn't go hunt anybody named Sebastian down. That would be awful. I would feel really bad about that. That's a trap. I play ranger. I know a trap when I see one. Anson, thank you. Muckler Douglas, I thought of the original desk about the fourth. This is John's advanced levels. The third one, because you, Anson, 89, back to the lap. Hope you join us in the team. It's on the way. Crank at the speakers. Don't touch your speakers. Giveaways every week. Please take a seat, but you're lonely near the edge. Mm. It's locked. into the spectre. Please stop. Hey! Hey! He took my hallway! Oh my god, you can't have skirt in Detroit. They'd steal your freaking hallways. What's this? 